An accidental trip across the Ambassador Bridge has landed a Mexican citizen in hot water and likely facing prison time here in Canada. It's because when the accused got here, CBSA found nearly $2 million worth of cocaine hidden in a spare tire in his trunk. Joining me tonight to explain this recent court decision is our Michelle Molesky. Michelle. Stephanie, in 2021, we first reported a Mexican citizen was charged with possession and importation of 18 kilograms of cocaine. At a trial, the accused said he didn't mean to come here and was only transporting the drugs to protect his family from a Mexican cartel. A Windsor judge has now acquitted Federico Jimenez Martinez on one charge and convicted him on the other. CTV News has obtained the CBSA surveillance video used in the criminal proceedings against Federico Jimenez Martinez. According to court documents, on August 29, 2021, Jimenez Martinez drove a black suburban across the Ambassador Bridge into Canada. He told authorities he didn't know he was in Canada until he saw the Canada patch on the officer's uniform at the booth. Once in secondary inspection, CBSA found this spare tire in the trunk. According to court documents, inside officers found 18 brick-like items of cocaine with an estimated street value of nearly $2 million. After he was arrested, Jimenez Martinez told authorities he was transporting the narcotics under duress for a cartel, whose members were allegedly threatening the safety of his family in Mexico. After a five-day trial, the Crown attorney on the case conceded there wasn't sufficient evidence to prove beyond a reasonable doubt Jimenez Martinez knew he was crossing into Canada. So Justice Kirk Monroe acquitted him of the importation charge. But Justice Monroe went on to say, I reject the evidence of Mr. Jimenez as to why he made the drug trip ending at the Canadian border. The judge found inconsistencies in Jimenez Martinez's evidence, including where he lived in the U.S., why he made the trip to Michigan, and what he did the morning the drugs were placed in his vehicle. Mr. Jimenez was not threatened to transport this cocaine, Justice Monroe said in his judgment, adding, Mr. Jimenez was a knowing participant in the drug conspiracy. Federico Jimenez Martinez has been convicted of drug possession and will face a sentencing hearing in June. Now, during that trial last December, court also heard there were no fingerprints on either the spare tire or any of the 18 brick-like items seized from Jimenez Martinez's vehicle that day. Now, in my online coverage, I go into more detail on other evidence heard at the trial, including testimony from Jimenez Martinez's brother, who told the court about phone calls he received after his brother went missing. You'll find that at ctvnewswindsor.ca. Stephanie. A lot to unravel there. Okay, Michelle mm -hmm. Molesky with our top story tonight. Thank you, Michelle.